Hello guys, have you ever felt so proud of yourself so as to call it arrogance? Maybe because of your economic status, a gadget you hold, your fame, a competition you won, or when you were bragging about a place that you went to. Keeping that in mind, let's look at this picture. This picture is called the pale blue dot. Look closely. It's a picture of the Earth taken by a Voyager 1 spacecraft from about 6 billion kilometers away, and it's the farthest picture of the Earth ever taken. In the words of Carl Sagan, an astronomer, astrophysicist, and many more, he said something very special about this picture. We succeeded in taking that picture. And if you see closely, you see a dot. That's here. That's home. That's us. On it, everyone you ever heard of, every human being who ever lived, lived out their lives. The aggregate of all our joys and sufferings, thousands of confident religions, ideologies, and economic doctrines, every hunter and forager, every hero and coward, every creator and destroyer of civilizations, every king and peasant, every young couple in love, every hopeful child, every mother and father, every inventor and explorer, every teacher of morals, every corrupt politician, every superstar, every supreme leader, every saint and sinner in the history of mankind, live there on a moat of dust, suspended in a sunbeam. And this makes me contemplate the size and enormity of our universe. Let me put things in perspective. There are eight planets in our solar system. And just like our solar system, there are millions of other solar systems that make up our Milky Way galaxy. And the number of galaxies just like our Milky Way galaxy in the entire universe is more than the grains of sand on our mother earth. And this is just a part of the story. These are parts of the universe that we as human beings can see and it's called the observable universe. But there is a whole another part of the universe called the unobservable universe which we as human beings can never see and will never be able to see even if we live eternally. And this unobservable universe is 150 sextillion times larger than the observable universe. The point is, this kind of figures give me perspective on how small our mother earth is how small our lives are and how small we as individuals are. So if we ever feel full of ourselves just because we've got X number of likes on our DP or we've won some accolade that we were trying to or we've got something material that we possess, then there is this beautiful suggestion by someone very wise. Go out under the night sky and look up at the universe and compare its size with yours. And the universe, I believe, does not care if we exist or not. But if we care about each other's existence, then we can get so much done. Think about it.